We are honored on this Giving Tuesday to announce to you our 2018 Tegna Foundation grant recipients. It's a process we take great pride in here at 13 News Now. Here they are. We are so fortunate that Tegna has allotted us actual funds to go and make a difference in our community. So the ability for us to have that and infuse this cash into a variety of organizations throughout Hampton Roads is, is really special and it's very special to have our entire team involved in that decision making process. One of the responsibilities I think we have as a newsroom is to cast a light on the many positive things that are taking place here in Hampton Roads. Access Virginia for a project to bring a theater sensory workshop for students with vision impairments. Chesapeake Humane Society for a project to provide microchipping services to stray animals and offer a walk-in clinic for cats. Clever Communities in Action, a group running a barbershop-based literacy program called Razor Sharp Readers, focusing on education and mentorship. Fear to Freedom, based out of Newport News to provide aftercare kits to victims of sexual assault, domestic violence, and child abuse. Max Strong Memorial Fund that will teach hundreds of children how to swim in our area. Samaritan House for their human trafficking initiative that is needed right here in Hampton Roads. Stop Abuse, an award-winning education program aimed to teach elementary school children how to recognize, prevent, and disclose sexual abuse. Transgender Assistance Program to provide emergency assistance to homeless transgender adults in our community. Wildlife Response, who place injured and orphaned wildlife into licensed rehab care with the goal of releasing them back into their natural habitat. And these are the groups in our community that are making an impact and we are honored to help provide them funding for their projects. Of course, you can learn more about each of these groups by watching our one hour documentary Impact Hampton Roads airing December 7th and 8 p.m. and Christmas Day in place of our new newscast. Of course, congratulations to all these groups. We are so proud to tell your stories.